Bellevue is moving to a larger location. Six News Philip Katafimo spoke with the organization about how they hope this new building will help in the fight against hunger. These are the operations at the Bellevue Food Pantry off Hancock Street. A select few bagging produce and shelf stable items for a community in need. The pantry says their biggest limitation is size. Right now we just give people two bags of food that's pre-filled by our volunteers. Other limitations are lack of space for volunteers, so we have to turn people away, unfortunately. Tie quarters make receiving donations difficult too, but changes are coming. On Tuesday, the pantry was officially handed the keys to its future home. After buying it in June, in about a year, the old Bellevue Library will become a food hub, expanding operations from a 1,000 square foot building to more than 20,000. This is a milestone to get the building, but as you can see, um, it's full of shelving and not quite ready. And so we'll spend the next couple of years with our bringing everyone to the table capital campaign to raise the funds necessary to renovate and have a full functioning pantry that really truly meets the growing needs of the community. Bowen says it's the perfect spot to help better serve their neighbors. Poverty is highest in this area of Sarpy County, and this is a perfect location because since 75, the library has been a place of safety and support and nourishment. And so we love the symmetry of coming into this place that's already known to transform it into, an, into truly a community asset, which is, which is what it will be. Expansion was needed. The pantry serves up to 1,400 people a month. Many of them are families. But the pantry says that number is growing to as many as 1,700 a month. The new location will feature a new walk-in fridge and freezers, a shared garden, and a community center to provide more resources. If somebody needs some help applying for WIC or somebody needs help meeting with the VA, we can connect them with that resource actually in the new pantry instead of having to send them out somewhere else. It's kind of hopefully going to be a one-stop shop for people. The pantry will continue to operate out of its current location for now. Renovations will begin next year. I love my job. I love being able to meet the people that come to the door and be able to help them and learn their stories and hopefully be able to put them on a path where they don't need to come to the pantry anymore. On your side in Bellevue, Philip Katafimo, 6 News. The total project costs a little more than $7 million. And a reminder, they are still in their old location until the new one is ready.